Let's hear it for him. Matt, 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 Matt. What's up, everybody? We're here with Mavis. Hi, Kana. Hi. Hi, Hi. Hey. Hi. And welcome, Mavis. Here she is. Yeah, <laughs> I'm behind the camera. She's behind the camera. Yep. Smelly, smelly so, where did you guys, the name for your band came from? Mm. The name of our band? Yeah. So, it was just a random name that we came up with because we couldn't think of anything. So, it's called Icona because 
I like the game Zelda Majora's Mask a lot, and there's a temple in Zelda called Iconic Canyon, so we took it from Zelda. Oh, cool. So, yeah. so you'll, you'll get a bunch of video game nerds like, dude, is your name from Zelda? I'll get those every now and then. We've only gotten but, like a handful of those. Yeah. Yeah. Zelda was a rad game, though. I mean, it's a legendary yeah. game. So you guys going to make that as your next merch? I have a Zelda really character. Have copyright issues. <laughs> we run into something like Got enough on our plate. The last one we want is some copyright Nintendo issues coming after sure. us. I mean, that'd be kind of sick, though. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't have to be exact. You can just like, or have you have all you guys dressed up as one of the characters? That would be kind of cool. Like a Halloween one. Year. Can I? Can I be Mario? I love Halloween. Be <laughs> 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 like Super Smash Bros. Really? We gotta play a Halloween show. I'm down. Again. It's been a couple years since then. Mm -hmm. So we just got done playing Soma out here in San Diego and it was so good. We haven't played here for probably, I don't know, six, seven months or something like that. Is it but, we yeah, since the summer. but we haven't headlined here for probably, fuck, I don't know, two years now, probably. I didn't play that. Sh well, I played the show, but we, we played before you guys. Yeah, we were enemies, I remember. Yeah. <laughs> enemies. He was ops before he was fam. <laughs> so what other venue do you guys perform at besides Soma? Um, well, Casbah, Humble, Humble Heart. We played a lot of uh, places here, and then we hit. We actually toured, too. We played oh. outside of California. Yeah, we've done Vegas. First tour in May, we got to June. play. Yeah, June. Yeah. We got to do San Diego started, and then we played at the Bancroft in San Diego. Then we went to Tempe, or sorry, we did San Diego, Vegas, then Tempe, then Albuquerque, then El Paso, El Paso Tucson, 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 and right. came back. So we did six okay, days on. straight. Mavis is Mavis is uh, doing an interview with us right now. <laughs> you can record all this. This is good stuff, huh? <laughs> <laughs> keep going, keep going. Do you guys want Mexican food? Hell yeah. Cali burrito. <laughs> California burrito. Three California burritos. <laughs> yeah. This you want one? Yeah. Four. Yeah. four. Can we make four? Money. Yeah, we'll, we'll pay you when we get to the house. Yes. Alright, thanks, babe. And a side of fries and a horchata. <laughs> 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 I had 7 Eleven the other day, and then I saw on their menu was like a, was a, a foot long churro. Oh my god. At 7 Eleven? Yeah. They got the whole spread out there now, dude. They Sorry, got like right. pizza, orange chicken and shit. You can get whatever you want. Orange chicken? <laughs> <laughs> they have orange chicken. I want a churro, like, orange chicken. That could not be healthy. And lasagna. Lasagna. Yeah, 7 Eleven lasagna. Like 7 Eleven. Yeah. 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 Get on the lasagna game. Sponsor. They got the $5 pizzas. Those actually aren't bad. They're actually better than... Those $5 pizzas are insane. They're better than like Domino's or Pizza Hut. They taste fucking great. I know that I do it it's going to and sometimes I do it anyway. I know it's going to be bad, but... Yeah. We get two tall cans and a fucking slice But if 7 Eleven came at us with like a deal, they're like, okay, you get to choose like free food from the hot bar all tour. Would you take you take straight wieners as well? No! If they approached yes. us and it was like free food, you would yes. take it? Nachos and shit? Yes, hot dogs? Come on, man. Orange chicken? It's gonna be yeah. a bad Orange tour, chicken. <laughs> that's, the, that's his breaking point. <laughs> oh, man. I got, right, I got the weakest question. stomach in the band, bro. Come on. Yeah. sponsorship. <laughs> yeah, that I now can stand talking. behind. Okay. Okay, well, now since we're still on food subject, but not really food, um... What drink, like alcoholic drink, would you guys want to be named after? Named after? Like we had our own. Mm. Yeah, if own we had our own. Of what? Like what manufacturer? Uh, like we could would you make anything. a beer with? PBR. Probably like PBR has been PBR, uh, yeah, yeah, dude. Um, yeah. a PBR huge trend in this world. Yeah. Yeah. What an icon of PBR. We got PBR. You know what the best tattoo. PBR is, Wait, though? Is the coffee PBR. That's all you coffee PBR. So yeah. we already have PBR tattoos, so like, that's just sponsor us PBR, 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 PBR. Keep the relationship. They don't have California burritos. Sorry, Mavis. We're <laughs> getting taxed. <laughs> <Texas. laughs> bean and cheese. Let's go bean yeah, and cheese. Right. Yeah, I'm not kidding. What kind of fucking... I know. What kind of they're going to like well, Mexican places right. she go to. Probably the one by our house, which is like... I forget the name of it. They got a coat. It's a little scary. Hmm. They don't got it's a... Uh, I forget. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little, it's a little, it's a little scary. Too bad. <laughs> you gotta reply like, they don't have beans. 
Yeah, it's right. <laughs> <laughs> tortillas. Right they ain't got tortillas. Yeah, PBR. That's PBR. Yeah, absolutely. Just back to that. Yeah, I think for me it depends. Like, I can either go for a uh, vodka crayon or pina colada or something. You know what I just bought the other day? Is vodka crayon class. Vodka uh, Trulies makes a vodka. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they do now. I'm not fucking huh. sure. Dude, PBR makes a vodka. $13, and it was pretty good. Too. Yeah. 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 Is that what it is? Like a clear whiskey. Yeah. But I'm going to stop drinking. After tonight, I'm not drinking for a long time. It's documented. Taking a break. Well, I do it all the time. It's documented. I'm not an alcoholic, guys. <laughs> no, he did just make every... a bar in his garage. And I, did, <laughs> I, I do have I a garage. I just a bar in my garage. I'm going to stop fucking drinking. I can yeah. stop it any time. Sure. Just not right now. Yes, watching this video is definitely wondering, hey, Icona, when are you guys going to put out a new song? Well, we actually don't have an answer for the date, but it's coming <laughs> soon. We do have a new song. It's we called do. Colorblind. We and just it's played it tonight for the first time. And yeah, we did really well. Maybe so do you film that song? I think so. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, colorblind. It's recorded, and we're just getting it mixed and mastered. So I mean, sooner than later. Yeah, I would say, I would say the next two to three months for sure. Two yeah, to three hopefully months. sooner than that. We're That's January. Awesome. By March, it's going to be out. What's you your, can... what's you guys' favorite song that you've record, recorded so far? Start all, here. all together, us. Yeah. Colorblind is the only song that James and I recorded with them. <laughs> Yeah, we're the newbies. We're the newbies. Yeah, <laughs> so this is our first introduction. So but I'll tell you my favorite Icona song. <laughs> it's called Subtle Worth, which is the name of their album. And that song rips. Banger. All of the songs are actually really good. That's I, Before I even played with Icona, I would listen to them and be like, dude, every song in this album rips. These kids should be bigger than what they are. And that's, Thanks, what, they got, that's, that's what they got me in the band. Because we're going we're gonna to get two extra people out of show. From here on out. Nice. <laughs> my favorite my wife record, and my friend. <laughs> my so, favorite to record was probably Place for the People. I think that that's just my favorite song on the record. And that's the song I did a music video for you guys. Yeah, he did a music joined. video for music before video. he was in the band. Yeah. But we just added a lot of extra like virtual instrument stuff to it, like strings and synthesizers, and I don't think a lot of our songs have that. So that was kind of interesting to see you know, who we were working with at the time, what it could, you know, turn yeah. into. Because we just had this kind of, like, general foundation of the song, and we recorded it with just, like, guitars, bass, and, you know, all Dude, the, the regular e stuff. every song on that whole album is, is killer. It's Every song is good, just as good as the next one, so. And the lyrics, this dude's a genius with lyrics. This dude's a genius. You know why? Hmm. Why? He reads I books. I don't know why. It takes me forever to talk about this. That's why I sit on it. Uh, <laughs> my favorite to record, old friends. You know what I'm saying? It got a little bit of tippy and tappy and on that one. Tappy. Yeah, branching out, getting better, self improvement. Huge. That's that's that's, that's, that's yeah. <laughs> yep. That's true. What about Depression. you, Robert? What was your favorite when we were recording? Mine. I don't even know this. I probably got like two. Honestly, I love I love State of Mind. Mm -hmm. It's just. It's a boppy cool. track. It's a good feel. Like, the it's just, too. just a good track. Yeah. Um, but I do have to say, family like, friendly. I do have to say, like, place for the people too. Just because, like, that was my introduction to Icona. Because when I joined, they already had two songs done out of the album, and that was my first, first like little, like, hey, like I have this, like you guys like, it? and we just kind of rolled with it, and it was a great time. And that too. I like knew right when I heard the riff that it was going to be a good song because he sent it through. I think it was just like a text or something. It was just like a very yeah, short, like a wave file, like a just short like a rough verse. recording. And I heard it, and I was like, okay, I know that the song is going to be something that is going to turn out good. Did Robert live in Arizona when you guys started? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah so he out, lives in Arizona. So we would, I live we would, in Arizona. When we were recording, I would literally take like my whole desktop setup, like, and we would rent out a couple <laughs> hours at your. It's spelled Y O R E. It's a practice studio here. Here, and I would literally, yeah, I would literally bring two eight-inch Mackie monitors, my interface, my computer screen, the desktop, all the cables, a fucking table, and we would set up a recording studio in this practice studio. Uh, Twenty-four there. pack of PBR. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> yeah those are real times. I kind of missed that. It was crazy. It was it was fun. Fun. Yeah. Well, we could do it again. <laughs> you guys just talk. the night's young. <laughs> it really did. Nice I think it did help like the, the writing process though, because it was like for one, we're paying for the time, so we didn't want to waste the time. Right. And we would okay. all sit there. So who was it? Man in charge. I was like, no, my ideas are the ones going to stick. We don't have time to sit here. No, we never, never, we never like did that. that. Like, like literally, like somebody would write like the smallest thing. 
Like and one we would just fucking vibe. Just build like, it. Like it would be like this, like it could just be like and then just fucking just, just go. Yeah. And it's just game on. And Very like, open know. writing process for sure. You'd be like, yeah, like what if we do this for this part? There's then, a like, few songs off the record that were jammed out too. Like I think anywhere but here I had like a vocal melody for the chorus that I wanted to do and I just kind of formulated chords around that. And then I think Ink was written. That one was jammed out. I think State of Mind was jammed out. State of Mind was. I think yeah, If They Want To was jammed out. So, I mean, the, the, a lot of that album was, like, written organically, like, how they did it back in the day. It wasn't like yeah. we would sit there. I mean, we had how we did it was we had our iPhones out taking video. And we would just jam. And then we would, parts. like, watch back. Yeah. And we'd be like, okay, I like that part. Let's, yes. like, build off that part. But yeah, that, that record was fun. I, I really want to do another one. <laughs> Oh, that is a light. Don't tell me the fucking open. band's dead, dude. That would suck. <laughs> oh, Did it shit. die? <laughs> Film this. <laughs> dude, that would suck. Ah, we're back in business. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be- Wait, so how, is it, how the hell is it 71? Idling? I don't know. Seventy-one dollars. She sent me the. Oh. Sh- what is she buying? <laughs> Hold on. Let me call her real quick. She said, what? How's it? How? How is it seventy dollars? Burritos are like twelve bucks a piece now. Yeah. Oh, the California. Yeah. Fifteen. Oh. Yeah, California okay. Never mind. For sure. Yeah, we're in California, and you got a California burrito. <laughs> they raised the price. Tax inflation. No, no, no. All right, we owe Dom seventy bucks. So okay. Strong. All right. Bye. Damn. For eleven. Well, no, fries it says, said T one. I'm like, why'd you get eleven things of fries? But yeah, the uh, let's see. She got a fish taco. That's five twenty five. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Keep <Yeah>. anonymous. <laughs> oh, each burrito is fourteen dollars. Yep, yeah, that's pricey. Yeah, California, you're expensive. It is. It's too expensive to live out here too. Yeah. Why I'll be moving soon. A uh, question for you, Mario. Yes. Between this band, Icona, and Night Like Thieves. What do you like performing with most? Oh, here we go. Oh, let's this go. Is good. <laughs> Dude, you can't ask me this question. It's this different. I play good. two different instruments. Mm. And it's just different. I can't. I can't say that. I can't answer that. You're pretty much. I like nights like these more than I come. <laughs> he sings on. Uh, <laughs> he sings on two nights like these. Nights like these songs that are coming out. It's different with Icona. I can move around a lot more. And, and not have to pay as much attention to what I'm playing. So basically, you have more fun playing with us yeah. because you're playing the business. That's your answer right there. Yeah, but uh, it, it's it's really hard to say. I can't I can't do that. They're both two different bands. That's but I've always saying. been a fan of Icona before I even joined their band. So. Well, what makes each band different? I play two different instruments and. Uh, M- music wise. It sounds different <laughs> and. They're like a more like post hardcore. Alternative, we're more like alternative pop folk, so it's like a little bit more poppy, I suppose. Plus, I hang out with Jake a lot. I don't hang out with anybody in nights like these. Well, Angel lives in Texas. Uh, Kiyoki's always working. Everybody's busy. Nights like these is definitely an older band, so I'm reliving my youth with these guys because <laughs> I'm only 34. For right now, so hell yeah, pops. Yep, that's what I'm talking I about. The same age. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was 20. Well, I can't pick between those two, it's, it's too hard. Can't. I like I like both of them. Nights Like Thieves is your baby. So you I did start Nights Like now. Thieves and I've done it for almost eight years, <laughs> so of course, I'm gonna be a little more biased towards that. But with Icona, yeah. it's different because I think they want to like do more, like they want to tour and. Dude, you know, it's harder for nights like these to do all that stuff right now. I don't know. They're both good. I like them both. It's hard to say. Because what's funny is when nights like these did tour, we listened to Icona. Huh. The whole time. We did a lot. Remember I would always send you stuff yeah, and I would, I would put you in our stories? Like, Icona. This band kills it. 
<laughs> so, yeah. Don't ever do that to me again. <laughs> Don't ask Dominica which girl, which wife I prefer. My <laughs> Dominica or the one that she doesn't know about. Hey, I'm just joking. Yo, I'm just joking. I'm, joking. I'm kidding. Edited. I'm joking. Yeah. Your California burrito is going to be fucking toilet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, fuck your burrito. That's Chapo's burrito. Oh, yeah, Chapo's. Chapo is my dog. All my animals are named after... <laughs> Uh, gangsters are like old, famous drug dealers. It's yeah, yeah. <laughs> pretty fun. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, next question. Okay. <laughs> so, what's like a typical uh, re rehearsal day look like for you guys? Late. Oh, well, you know, late. always showing up on time. Yeah. Early. <laughs> yeah. Always ready say. to go. Always get the, late. Get the room warmed up a little bit. It takes yeah. about 30 minutes to figure out a PA, which he likes to do. It is shorter, though, than it used to be. I mean, fuck, we would be in there for three, four hours sometimes. Yeah, Back now it's day, like we now just run like through the hour, hour, and then I just want to, like, that's, I usually am just getting off work, so I'm like, dude, let's just practice. Yeah, we share a practice space with two other bands, which is Nights Like Thieves, and then Steve from Nights Like Thieves, other band, Dresden's Burning and Icona. So we have three bands in there, <laughs> and uh, we don't really have a schedule, huh? No, Everybody's <laughs> kind of like, oh no, you guys practice, like everybody's like in a, well, we go through different, like, Dresden's Burning will like hit me up to hit up Icona, see what's going on, and I guess the same for, oh, yeah. yeah, like, are you guys practicing tonight, are you guys going to, I don't know. Right, well, then we're gonna go in. Yeah, we work so it's kinda, schedules yeah, and schedules. We have the worst schedules for all three bands. Just kind of yeah. rotate. It's kind of just uh, first come first serve. Well, I guess. What was your first How impression you of, of our band, Icona? This is yeah, Mavis. Is a, us. Just turn the camera on, Mavis. Okay. Did you, did you have fun? Did you like it? You guys want to hold my camera? You can. I'll, I'll hold it. You want me to film you? Sure. Okay, here, I'll do. I'll do that. This is for Mavis. <laughs> all right, ask the question. <laughs> so, Mavis, this is your first time seeing Icona. Did you have a good time? And did you? Like everything that you heard? Yes. Besides the mosh pits that every, every other band had to like move away. You don't like the mosh pits? I don't do mosh pits. Uh, like the one time when, um, what band did I see? When I saw New Skeletal Faces at the Marrow and the band that opened before them, um, Mood of a Sinner, one of their songs, a mosh pit came, the dude was jumping all the way around and then he, I fell and um, fell my back. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Is there a moshing at the Moreau or the Marrow? Yeah. See, what do you call it? The Marrow or the Moreau? Yeah. That's I a like whole San Diego Marrow. thing. Yeah. I like calling it the Moreau. The Moreau. That sounds better. Yeah. So, it sounds like a classy, like, like wine. Where are you going to? The Moreau. No, not where you drink. Where are you going to? The Moreau. It's Merlot. The Merlot. Oh, yeah, Moreau. Did you guys ever think of... Uh, no, Harry, it's Moreau. Uh, performing in that venue? Or, like, we have. Yeah. Oh well, I'm sure twice. <laughs> yeah. Probably. What's crazy is like you got, the time you guys played. I actually wasn't even there. That was the only yeah icon that I. Nights like these missed. played that one too. Yeah, nights like these played. But that's yeah, the night I thought was cool was the little fucking. Uh, they had like this thing that you would stand on, and there was lights. Oh up. yeah, it's way different now. They completely yeah. changed it up. I thought that was cool. I Mavis. <laughs> hey everybody! Thanks for what I think we're. <laughs> We got a well, we don't, we don't, yeah, yeah, we, too. Dominic is texting me. She's like, hurry up and cut. Her face is going to get cold. <laughs> but we want to say thanks to Mavis. Subscribe, like, comment on do her channel, things. all her videos. All the she supports a lot of bands, which a lot of people don't do that anymore. Comes yep. out and takes her time to do this. So you better be subscribed. Yeah, you better subscribe. like and comment. Hit the bell. Hit the <laughs> yeah. bell. Hey. Yeah. See ya. Hit that bell. Icona! Thank you. Yay. Stream it. Whee. Spotify. YouTube. Apple Music, Deezer, Tidal, Deezer. you know it all. Yeah. <laughs> all right. All the things. <laughs> Bye, Mavis. <laughs>